What do you do when people no longer perform, but live in their humanity and share that humanity with the characters that they're pulling off of a page? What do you do with that? You don't want to get in the way of it. We did Hamlet as the first show here in San Pedro, and there's this great line about how art is, is it's sort of a reflection. It's a mirror held up to the human experience, and Shakespeare says it like that. Um, and at its best it is. You don't have to agree with everything that you see, but when it's real, when it's true, whether it's a painting or a song, it makes, it hits you, it broadens you, it stretches you, it makes you wonder at your own humanity. The goal that we have for the theater that we do over here at Theatrum Elysium is theater that stretches your humanity, theater that brings you present, that lets you feel the temperature on your skin, that lets you taste the sweat, not literally, sometimes, of the actors who are all around you, but doesn't let you escape. We need to be present as human beings in order to figure out what it means to be a human being. And if we do anything right in this building, it's that we wear our hearts on our sleeves, we wear our humanity on our sleeves, and we allow the characters and the poetry to give us that permission. Shakespeare says things that I can't process and put into words, but I'm only going to infuse Shakespeare's language with my soul and speak my truth. And if you're next to me and you hear that truth, and it resonates in a way that complicates things for you or expands things for you. And that's theater. And that's what, what I want from a theater company, what I want for artists who work in Theatrum Elysium, is a mentality, a forged perspective of creation. And creation is not supposed to be about knowing how to get there. It's supposed to be about the bravery of scratching itches inside of yourself. And I want to create a community over here where people have the ability to have an itch, scratch at it, and be marveled at that. To look around at their peers, and their peers are patient with their discovery process. Because inspiration doesn't work on a timeline. And so that moment, that lightning bolt strike, where we understand how to speak our like eternal truths, poetically, we don't know when it comes to find us. So we need a group that sets us up for success, that sets an atmosphere up for creativity and wonder and collaboration and an ensemble spirit. What am I looking for? I guess I'm looking for meaning. I'm looking for an ability to express myself. When somebody walks in the door and tries to audition for this company or want to be involved with us, we have a mentality, which is we're here to discover you versus judge you. I guess that's what I want. I want to be in a place that wonders. I want to be in a place where I can wonder with them. I want to be working with artists that aren't satisfied but are proud of their accomplishments. And it's all ideal. I don't know how any of this stuff is real other than dedicated effort. What I would want from Theatrum Elysium to be a home for people who are creative in the fullest sense. They start with a blank canvas, they feel the swell of having something to say, and they feel the world ready to listen to what they have to say. And, and we are, everybody that walks in this door. Why is it important to come see theater? It is a point in our lives right now where I myself am going to tell you my head is in my phone more than it is in the contact with the people that I'm around. I live in a world where I have a lot of responsibilities, and I spend most of my time trying to get ahead of that and trying to be ready. I review things that happen in my life all the time in order to be better and, uh, the next time that may happen or to learn from it and grow and process. I don't spend enough time in the moment. I don't spend enough time feeling the air and the temperature on my skin. I don't always hear the lilt in the voice when someone says, how are you doing today? I don't, when someone hugs me, hugs me, I always feel their body touching my body. Not always. I mean, I do kind of, but like, do I really feel it? Theater's important because it's here, it's now, it's present. We have one goal over here at Theatrum Elysium, which is to make sure that you get the opportunity, communally, we all do, to be, as, to be present together. That it's not us watching people who are present, actors, performers who are living in the moment, but all of us deciding to taste the truth of what is in front of us and to confront it. Well, I would swim by the river is so wide and I'm scared I won't make it to the other side. Well, God knows I failed, but he knows that I've tried.